Victor's farewell begins today on Days of Our Lives, a new proposal is made, and Chad explains himself to Stephanie. Stephanie says she is aware that Chad advised Alex to stay away from her after she spits wine in his face. Chad erupts, thinking Alex was eager to violate their gentlemanly pact. Alex nearly blew a business transaction trying to keep it from Stephanie, according to Stephanie, who emphasizes that she had to coax it out of him. Chad extends regrets. He is aware that he was being a jealous jerk and that she dumped Alex for the same reason. He pleads, can you forgive me? Or are we also finished? In order to invite Alex to Victor's welcome home party, Justin seeks him in small bar. Alex is unsure if he would be accepted. Justin claims Maggie invited him though. Victor is suffering because of Beau, so family is the main theme here. When Alex continues to dither, Justin begs his son to carry out the task for him. Alex concurs. He won't encounter Chad, at least, not directly. Alex acknowledges that he might have accidentally ruined his friendship with Stephanie when Justin asks. A glam rock-looking Bonnie paints her toenails in the Kyriakis home. When Maggie gets back from Chicago, she informs Sarah that she is expecting Xander's child. Bonnie observes Maggie doesn't seem to be in the mood for a party after checking on the kitchen for Victor's party. Sarah merely threw Maggie because she didn't want Sander to know the truth. These kinds of lies have no positive outcomes. Sarah informs Rex in Chicago that Maggie is aware of her pregnancy with Xander's child. She is concerned that Xander will hear from someone who knows too much. She has no control over whether or not he interacts with her child. She could marry him, Rex counters. In addition to perhaps assisting in a custody dispute, if everyone believes he is the father, she can safely return to Salem. Sarah is just unsure if it is the solution. Rex can definitely handle both of them. Being wed to her would bring him more happiness than anything. He hasn't and won't ever stop loving her. Belle informs Chloe outside the pub that Brady was compelled to give Rachel to Kristen. She hopes Brady will have Chloe's backing. She's reminded by Chloe that they're not dating. Brady also doesn't exactly encourage her friendship with Xander. Chloe tells Belle that Xander proposed when she disparages him. Belle is horrified to learn Chloe didn't simply reject him. In the square, Xander encounters a downcast Brady. He thinks his downcast attitude is a result of him and Chloe getting married. Brady must understand that Xander is making jokes. Xander acknowledges that Chloe is considering his proposal, but he still aims to transform Chloe Lane into Chloe Cook. Brady believes he is delusional and simply asked Chloe to marry him as a way of getting even with his ex-girlfriends. Xander dismisses his claim as sour grapes, checks into his apartment, and then leaves for Victor's party. Stephanie tells Chad at their apartment that she isn't leaving him but that there is just so much she can put up with. Instead of doing something behind her back, he ought to speak to her. Chad swears he won't ever try to manipulate her again. She questions why he was so vindictive as to trick her. She is the first person Chad has allowed himself to feel anything for since Abigail, he says. He is scared of it all disappearing once more. Sarah claims that she believed Rex dumped her in Chicago. He replies that one of his greatest regrets in life is destroying their marriage. He might have a chance to mend something that was never meant to be broken with the help of this child, and to let her know that she has and always will have his heart. He formally pops the question while down on one knee. Belle is told by a defensive Chloe that Xander has changed. Belle is merely attempting to be a good friend who is honest. Chloe responds that even the closest of friends may support one another, as she did when Belle cheated on EJ. Until Chloe reminds her she is a grown adult who can make her own decisions, they argue on. She would value Belle treating her with grown-up respect. Belle gives in, but she promises to kick Xander's ass all the way to Scotland if he strays even once. The buddies embrace and handshake. I cherish you. Justin ponders whether Alex still harbors romantic feelings for Stephanie at small bar. Alex acknowledges that he hasn't fully moved on from her, but he was trying. There is just such a harsh dating culture there. He can certainly use a cunning link, however. Alex tells Justin not to worry about it when he inquires about what that is. When Justin realizes he has been oak, loomered, he gapes. Though he didn't want to, Alex tells his father to rejoice in his single status. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel, Daily Bulletin News, and stay with us.